every long trip begins with this light, which seems to me to be unduly long. I wait here all the time. Today I took the windshield off. It's a nice day. This is Spelunkers. Spelunkers Cavern Burgers. I don't know what a cavern burger is, but I expect I'll find out. This place was highly recommended to me by a guy who lives nearby me in Front Royal. Warren Rifles Confederate Museum on 95 Chester Street. I've been by this place a number of times, but I've never stopped in. Okay. So, Wapping Heights was a battle that was fought right along with modern Route 55, yeah, and about, this is uh, east of Front Royal. Wapping Heights is High Knob now. What, what is here? What would I see on Route 55 uh, that would tell me I'm there? Anything in particular? The uh, entrance to High Knob right there. Oh, okay. Here's Linden, so that's uh -huh. where the Apple place is, right? right? Okay. All right. Gee, they're riding through a Civil War battlefield and didn't even know it. All the time. In Virginia, anywhere you go, you are. A red flag. Thirty star United States flag. Colors of the Lee Battery, Virginia Light Artillery. All right, here's an odd exhibit. A turtle captured by a Yankee soldier after the Battle of Gaines Mill in 1862. On the bottom of the turtle is carved Company G, 33rd Rhode Island Regiment. A turtle. A 150-year-old turtle. This is an interesting collection of signatures of Confederate generals. Robert E. Lee, his son, H. F. Lee, I can't see exactly what that is. Fitchy Lee is very ornate. And then you got another Lee, it looks like G. W. C. W. I can't tell. The Lee family. Looks like his dad though. Look at the, all these members of one family who served in the Confederate Army. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen members of the Buck family. Here's an odd thing. A seashell memorial to T General Thomas Stonewall Jackson. Made and presented by Mrs. Thomas J. Jackson to Lee Camp Confederate veterans in Richmond, Virginia.
brakes. Here's the scene at Patriot Harley-Davidson in Fairfax. They're setting up for the ride of the Patriots on this Memorial Day weekend. There are a lot of bikes here. A lot going on. I went inside the dealership to enjoy the air conditioning. Here's an interesting thing about motorcycles. Motorcyclists like patches. And if you have patches, you have to sew patches. So you get this sewing station wherever there are motorcyclists gathered. <laughs> Something in common with my wife's quilting, I guess. I don't know. And this is my practice, ending my trip today at the Clinton store. How many of these people are here for Rolling Thunder this weekend? I don't know. Ride free, brother. Ride free.